Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Digimon World Dawn and today we will be going into Dark Moon City to try and bring Chief Julia and Chaos Gallant Mom to their senses now I've actually been in here already just like doing some training I'm gonna run you through my team now we have a Polymon at level 82 fully maxed out now so it cannot go any further we have Shine Greymon Ruin Mode at level 78 with its techniques, it's brand new and it's final one that it can learn, Destroy Cannon. We also have Laser Blade, Nanomech Heal, not like I'll use it much, Chaos Blast and Torrid White, Weiss, Weiss, I'm not sure how to pronounce that, I think it's Weiss. And we also have Gallant Mon Crimson Mode after so long we finally have it. It is right here. Techniques Fatal Cross Shine Slash Giga Breath Double Blade and Invincible Sword. It's not learned a new technique so far, but I'm pretty sure I will sooner or later. And we have Giga Seedrum on the final member of our team. With Energy Shot, Laser Blade, Triple Wave, Power Blaster and Giga C Destroy. We have Egomon, the most powerful out of our group with 597 attack. It has Air Thunder, Fatal Cannon, Petrifier, Spiral Claw and Sea Phoenix. And last but not least, we have Neptune Mon. So I uh, got this from Dragomon quite a long time ago. It's at level 67 with Dark Claw, Curse Slash, Ocean Wave, Gigason Hydro, and Vortex Pike. I think the Ocean Wave is the final move it learns. So it's learned its last move. So let's go and try to help out Chief. Julia and Chaos Gallant Mom. By the way, to get the um, necessary thing, I'll show you in a bit once we've done this. Control. Good night. I just. Mm. I was just too OP. So OP right there. Alright, so I'll show you where to get it from. You get it, you get the necessary thing you need from this girl here, Baron. Uh, once you beat her, you can then go to Chief Julius' place. Actually, I think you've got to beat all three of the tamers. Uh, there's one, I'll show you where the other two are now, actually. I've already beaten them. Because uh, they were part of my training, so. But yeah, so you gotta be Baron. You gotta be, I think it's guts and punch. Then that's what they're called: guts, punch, and Baron. It's basically the um, the idiots of the dusk lot. You know, the ones that actually never really get anywhere in there. And the team, they always get themselves into trouble. So if you watch my Digimon Dusk series, you'll know who I'm talking about. Because we had to save them in Sunken Tunnel. Which I wasn't very happy about, to be honest. Yeah, so... Yeah, it's... So Guts is there. Punch, I think, is somewhere around... Yeah. Punch is here, and then Baron is just in the room below, which I'll, which I've already showed you. So I think you've either just got to be Punch or you've got to be all three. I mean, not Punch. Either you got to be Baron or all three. Don't know why I said Punch because I clearly said Baron because I got it from Baron. Yeah, so I did a bit of training here, I wasn't really getting up in levels, so I went to Macro C again just to get, like, loads of experience, like, literally, 
the best place to train is Macro Sea. Because you get megas to fight there. So really that is your best place to train and get all the good Digimon experience. And let's come in. Oh come on! I you know it's good. Soul Blaster. No, I'm not that. I'm not, I'm not messing about trying to escape. No one I can just destroy the enemies. Let's do it. Here's Gallimon Core. So there you go, right there you can see the power of Invincible Sword by Chaos, by Gallant Mom Crimson Mode. And look, I'll get to use him again. Seems about he didn't get a challenge, that was so unfair on him. I just, I felt a bit unfair doing that, it seemed a bit too easy. Oh, we have been challenged. Mm, that's gonna wrap up this episode so in the next we will go to the chaos brain and we will be able to fight the final boss for the main story until then i will see you guys later bye